The man accused of killing his family in Macosta County last month is now facing murder charges. Sheriff's Office gave us an update on where the investigation stands today. Lauren Edwards joining us live from Big Rapids with the details. Lauren? Yeah, Janice Max, that man is 51 year old Charles Gillard and the prosecutor making uh, the announcement that he's got murder charges against him, making that announcement just a few short hours ago here at Big Rapids Public Safety and that if he is convicted, he is facing life behind bars. Before we get started, uh, if we could everybody bow your heads just for a moment of silence for Don, Caitlin, Ronnie and Joshua, please. The Macosta County Sheriff's Office remembering the family killed in Austin Township. I don't know if you can ever uh, be ready for uh, what we saw that day. Uh, three young lives. But I think it affected everybody that was there present that day. On Friday, May 27th, deputies and Michigan State Police responded to a home on 180th near Johnson Road in Austin Township due to a deadly shooting. Four people were dead. 40-year-old Don Gillard and her three kids, six-year-old Caitlin, four-year-old Ronnie, and three-year-old Joshua. Sheriff's Office says the suspect was Charles Gillard, husband to Don and father to the kids, who then shot himself but survived. Now he's facing murder charges for their deaths. Charles Gillard will be arraigned on the following charges. Count one, homicide, open murder. Count two, felony firearm. Count three, homicide, open murder. Count four, felony firearm. In total, he's facing four counts of murder, four counts of felony firearms, along with several counts of child abuse in the first degree. The sheriff's office says he's currently recovering at the University of Michigan Hospital. No arraignment date has been set. We expect that to happen in the next couple weeks as his prognosis with the University of Michigan is good. So again, Gillard is recovering at the hospital. And once again, it's so important to know that that arraignment is coming in the coming weeks. Reporting live here in Big Rapids, Lauren Edwards, Fox 17 News.